Hey guys, welcome back to another Requiem tutorial video. I'm sorry I was gone for a while, but I am back now, and in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make and publish custom shirts. So, the main thing about custom shirts is you need Requiem Plus to even get started with custom shirts and use that feature. If not, I'm sorry, but if you have Requiem Plus, this is where you should be. So first you get the board out, you have to be in your own dorm room. You can't be in a friend's dorm room, you have to be in your dorm room. So I'm gonna go into my watch, go into my backpack, and we're gonna wanna select the clothing customizer. Once you do that, a big board will come up. So once it comes on for the first time, you will have a blank orange shirt or whatever color it is. And all you really need to do to use it is, all your marks are here, you can change the base shirt color. This big menu comes up, you can point at the scroll wheel, and scroll you can select any of these colors that you want and let's just go let's do like you know what, what are we feeling today let's do let's do a pineapple i'm feeling a pineapple today so we can go ahead grab any of these i recommend do not use a color that's your shirt because i see it will barely show up you can point out your little character hold down your trigger and you can spin them around and you can see our little mark there is on the back of the shirt. So the front of the shirt will have the little neck hoop in it. So let's take our black marker and just like draw something. Let's just call this one. Sorry about my handwriting. It's really bad. I know. Don't worry about it. So let's just do YouTube tutorial. There we go. It's fantastic. So you can design your shirt however you want. You can write stuff on it, but there is rules to shirts as of everything else in Rec Room. Just be smart about it. Have fun with it. Don't do anything too crazy with it. Um, if you draw anything outside on this gray area, it will not show up on the shirt. So as you can see, I did put a little bit, but it doesn't matter because all that other stuff doesn't show up. It's just that little bit. You can obviously erase it. Now you can also spawn in your own markers using the maker pen and your own erasers and you can size erasers so you're not limited to just these drawing tools. So let's just like fill in the bottom with like some black, just add some design. Right, let's just, I'm feeling black stripe right there. Unfortunately, you cannot color in the sides. So if you try the sides, it will not work. And you can see we can line up directly to the back. And I am no artist in any means. So, there we go. We got like a little black belt with our YouTube tutorial shirt. So once you finish designing your shirt, how you publish your shirt, you want to press on create. You can obviously save your shirt and it will save your progress on your shirt if you want to get off or maybe go join a friend for a little bit, just take a little break. But we're going to press on create and your washer menu will open. So we can put in a name of the shirt. I'm just going to name it tutorial because it's a YouTube tutorial shirt and description we can also put down tutorial sometimes it will glitch and doesn't show text but it's there you can see the character count up there and scroll down we want to press this drop down menu so everyone can see it and then we can put in our price that we want to sell it at here so it can be anywhere between 1,000 10,000 tokens so I'll go in between for 5,000 once you do that Oh, I apologize. It has to be 10 characters for the description. Tutorial. Bid. Awesome. So once you meet all the requirements for 10 characters, three characters for the name, clothing costs, permissions, everyone, you can save it. And once you save it, it's going to be published. So I'm not going to publish this one. Actually, yes, I will publish this one. I'll just take it down. So I will save it. As you can see, make sure that there's no sexual content, discriminatory content, or illegal content on this shirt, because you will be punished for it. So press create shirt, it will say creating, and once it's done loading, success. You finally have your first published shirt. So people can buy these shirts, you can go on the Inking Discord, I'll link the Inking Discord in the description below. There you can submit it to be um, a featured shirt. Um, the featured submissions are always changing for subjects, such as the most recent change, dorm rooms and inventions. I won't go into that, but this could be an outdated way in the future to get it featured, but people can still see it without it being featured. So now, if I go up here, click on my profile, 
I'll scroll down a little bit and there's our shirt so now if you do want to remo remove a shirt you can go into your watch go to your shirt press edit and you can go ahead and delete that shirt success and that is everything you need to know about making and publishing your custom shirt again I'm sorry if you do not have record plus it is a requirement that you do but I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial video if you want me to do tutorials on any subject anything leave it in the comments below and I will get to your comments if you have any questions for me or or anything for me leave it in the comments um, that's everything for the tutorial guys and I'll see you guys in a future tutorial goodbye that was cheesy no I can do a better one Bye.